Welcome back. I'm Captain Xavier, and I'm still joined by Admiral Willow and their magnificent glasses. Pack. And today we have this thing. This is the Hammerwald? Hammerwald, yeah. The Hammerwald from Domochevsky, uh, who has sent me some just ridiculous sling. The belt-fed magazine and some other amazing shell-ejecting things. This is a shell-ejecting blaster that is designed to fire Mega XL or Quad Elite, which is just amazing and fantastic. It is a flywheeler. It is pump action to feed. It does take magazines of shells, which is just fantastic. It lights up. It revs. It has a solenoid. It is solenoid powered and then massive flywheels that can fire four darts or Mega XL. Apparently it chews up the Mega XL as it goes, but oh God. I have the capacitor one somewhere. Oh yes, here. It uh, tears heads off and does all sorts of unpleasant things, but uh, it's the price you pay for firepower. Yes. Um, and uh, we're gonna go play with it. So glorious. We'll come back and we we might talk some more about it. I don't know if there's more to say. I I just want to I want to plink. Yeah. I want to fling foam down range with this thing. So uh, here we go. Grab the stuff. Right, here on the range some more with Admiral Willow, and I have the Hammer Vault. This thing is amazing. It's got lights, it's got a voltmeter, it makes a lot of noise, it fires big things, it goes ka-chunk, I love everything about it. And so I'm gonna plink with it. Apparently I do need to be careful, because this this whole back end is kind of has no shroud, and will catch the beard. So let's see, can I hit anything at all with it? Uh, As you notice, it does have slam fire. And we can quickly reload it. Let's see if we can hit anything. I want to get the 25. No. Hey. I got it. Hey. I hit the one behind it. I want one. That is cool. Right, I got one more mag of the Mega XLs, and then we can go to uh, the shotgun. No, it's something. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we do any better firing four darts at once. Every single one of those but one hit the the pan. So. Yeah, yeah. That is a that is so cool. The Mega XL is definitely likes to fly all over the place. Indeed, but. I've got more shells, so I'm gonna load up. load up a mag. Nope, I'm, there we go. Look at the shell mess. <laughs> Good. <laughs> we do need to show you that. Look at this mess. It's magnificent. All right, so I've got this. They have the. Crusher? Ba boom dozer. Boom dozer. The boom dozer. There's also a pump action Mega XL, so. And also shoot six. Yeah. So uh, we'll see who can hit the 25 the most. Okay. Ready? Yep, you go first. Oh. None for you. Oh. Oh. It's not cycling. I'll move my Make hand. It. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I hit something. I shall have one in my life someday. Soon. 
Alright. Yeah. Let's go talk about it some more. Oh, we have to clean up this mess. Yes. Good morning. Run for it. Right. What is there to say about this magnificent monstrosity? I want one. Um, shell ejecting is generally not a gimmick I'm hugely into. I do have a few shell ejecting blasters that I like, but this one I really like. The fact that it fires Mega XL and Quad Elite is just amazing. Um, and it's beefy and it's bulky and it's ridiculous. It's uh, loud. Uh, yeah, I would probably design a shroud back here so it doesn't catch my beard, but... Uh, other than that, that's just a neat design. I love Domachevsky's work. He, he goes above and beyond and does big and ridiculous things, and I appreciate that. So I'll have to reach out to him, see if it can be arranged. Pretty nifty. What kind of what kind of FIPS does it get? Have we have we looked into that? Let's find let me out. Go, let me go FIPS it real quick, get you some numbers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that 90 and the 83 is pretty... Yeah, 90, ridiculous. 89, 83, and then, seven, and then 378s yeah. in a row. Which I so, think the 78s was probably with new darts. Probably. And yeah, it is were... It is rough on darts. It tears heads off. It's, yeah, it sands them down like I mean, a belt sander. Let me find a sanded one. Yeah, which might actually be an advantage if you're trying to use them in, in blasters where there's a really tight fit. This would loosen up the fit a little bit. Oh, yeah. What, what, what do we got? After 10, 10 yeah, yeah. or so shots. It's, I don't know if it's going to show up on camera, but uh, you can see it's the neck has been kind of filed and yeah. They start to get little mouths after a while. Yeah. <laughs> the head starts to come loose. The, the head's all scuffed up. It's rough on them, but uh, it's fun. And uh, if you eject the shells on plastic or on concrete, it, it's, it's bad. They're, they're a little thin. But, uh, print more! Print more! Yes, that's yeah. the nice thing, is you can just print more, and it looks like they print without supports. supports yeah, yeah no so supports. it'd be real easy to print. Anyway, that's The Hammervold by Domochevsky. If there are any links that I can find, I will put them in the description. His Etsy. His Etsy. Yeah. I will have to look in, reach out and look into getting one, because this thing is absurd and I like it. Uh, yeah. Thank you for bringing it over for of me to course, play with. Of course. And thank you guys for watching. Yes. Run for it. Get the things.